Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add a Windows Update right-click context menu item to your computer. So that way when you right-click you'll have several Windows Update options. So to do this it's just going to be a simple registry addition. So we have one for Windows 11 here. So rather than show you all the individual steps and make you have to add them manually, we just have a, a simple file you could just add here. I also have one for Windows 10. It's a little bit different. It looks kind of the same, but there are some differences. So if you're on Windows 10, so you could try this one out. And then we have one for removing it. So if I look at the uh, Windows 11 one, for example, since that's what we're on, open it with Notepad. You can see all the things you need to add, so there's quite a bit of them. But they're all going under desktop background. And then you can see the removal. It's pretty simple, just removing this desktop background shell Windows Update section there. All right, so to do it, we're just going to double click it and run it. Say yes to the prompt. Say yes. Okay. Now when we right click, of course, for Windows 11, you have to go to show more options. So we have a video or actually a couple of videos on how you could get this back to the Windows 10 style so you don't have to do the show more options. And now you have Windows Update. So if you just do this, it'll take you to the uh, settings right there. And then you have other options. Schedule the restart, like that. And also, if you hold down Shift when you right-click, then you could bypass the Show More Options, by the way, if you didn't know that. So, you know, several different sections there. So it's pretty handy if you go to Windows Update a lot or do a lot of uh, configuration or just want to see what's going on. And like I said, to remove it, just uh, double-click this guy here. So run it. Say yes, yes. And now shift right click, it's gone. All right, so I will put all of three of these in the descriptions with links so you could just uh, download them so you don't have to add them manually. And then you could try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.